Installing the vertical support assembly requires careful consideration for the position of each plate. When mounting to wooden or metal stud walls, one of the vertical side plates must be mounted directly to a stud. For illustrative purposes, we will refer to it as the aligned stud. It is unlikely that any other stud will align with the second side plate. All hardware for each wall type can be provided by the project contractor or included as an option from Captive Air. Install the upper wall support plate centered behind the duct run with the top lip of the plate one inch above the bottom of the duct V-band you choose to support. When mounting into wooden or metal studs, the upper support must be mounted onto a minimum of two studs. Do not yet attach the mounting plate to the aligned stud. Instead, install a screw at the end of the plate to temporarily secure it in place. In some cases, mounting holes may have to be drilled into the upper and lower supports to align with the wall studs. Repeat these steps to install the lower wall support plate. The lower wall support plate should be located so that when installed, the lower wall support mounting holes align with the side plate mounting holes located on the bottom mounting tab. Next, install the side plate that will secure directly into the aligned stud. You must install the plate flush with the ductwork. You must also attach the plate using all existing mounting holes to both the upper and lower supports. Install the second side plate to the wall. You must install the plate flush with the ductwork. This plate will likely fall between two studs and if so, secure using 5 16 by 4 inch toggle bolts and washers. Install the rear top support plate by securing it to the side plates using 5 16 18 nuts and bolts. Be sure the half inch flange faces up. Install the front top support plate the same way. The V-band V should sit on top of the flat plate. Align the V-band bracket with the cutout on the front top support plate so it doesn't interfere with the top of the plate. Secure both side support plates to the outer duct shell using the 5 16 18 by 1 1⁄2 inch self-drilling screws. Use the guide holes to locate the shell center and fill all holes center, center left, and center right. A minimum of 18 screws must be used on each side of the duct. Ensure that the fasteners have made full contact with the duct. 